was um, looking at pre-law and politics. So I had, I had started off at a law firm actually out of college and, and had mid transition to stats. So when I reached a point at stats where I was kind of looking around saying, how do I upskill or what's my next sort of trajectory? And I had reached a little bit of a plateau there, I felt. Um, and so I started looking around into sort of more broad based sport business programs because I felt like I had excellent experience to offer a program at stats, but also that I was a little bit green uh, or a little bit naive as to what the overall ecosystem of sport management looked like. I knew a very small niche of it, but mm -hmm. I think I was curious to see what other segments existed. And I didn't feel like I had gotten a sort of formal management training necessarily at my undergraduate institution. So um, I'm from Boston originally. Um, and I started looking around and, you know, knew that UMass Amherst had the top ranked program in the in the United States and it mm -hmm. was really one of the oldest programs. Uh, we're celebrating our 50th anniversary next year and it's we're one of a few programs that have actually started the um, concentration of sport as a management discipline back in the 1960s. So I looked at it and fell in love with it uh, on a visit and, and met their faculty and just felt like at that time it was a really nice way to level up my education, skill up in some in some quantitative areas, mm -hmm. but also access a larger network than I had at Stats. Um, I had a pretty good sport industry network coming into the program, but um, UMass had you know three thousand plus alumni who are working in industry and who are willing to pick up the phone for you. Um, at the time, I really wanted to leverage my statistical experience at stats into a job in a front office of a major league baseball team. And at the time, UMass had three general managers in major league baseball and had really the, the best pipeline of any program in the world at placing people inside of, uh, of the baseball ops world. Um, so that was really dro drove my decision. And um, it was a tough decision to leave Chicago. My wife and I, my wife's from there and we, we loved it there. And it was a fantastic place to live and work and play. Um, but it was a, it was the right move to pursue. I ended up doing a dual degree, an MBA and an MS in sport management. So they have a, a 20 month program that's a two year and gives you sort of the formal MBA as well as a master's in sport.